I used to live in Seattle and I left Seattle and I called my mom one year and I said, you know what? I give up. I can't afford to buy everybody back home all their gifts and then ship them across the country. So I'm not going to get anybody anything because I think that's fair. And she cracked herself. <laughs> Christmas is extremely important to my mom. And she goes, well, Alicia, if you don't buy them their gifts, then how will they know that you love them? I'm broke. They know I love them. You know what I'm saying? And she goes, well, I just really think you should get something for everybody. And it, it bothered her so much that she actually went out and she bought all of my friends their gifts from me, which was cool. But she didn't ask what would be a good idea to get each person. So she got a few things that I wouldn't have gotten, like John, for example. She got him a book on Kwanzaa. I said, Mom, that's kind of inappropriate. You know what I'm saying? That's kind of like going, well, Merry Christmas, black guy. <laughs> Let's get him something else. You know what I'm saying? Like a book or a gift certificate to a strip club. I know, John, that's what he wants. I guarantee you. She goes, well, I put a lot of effort into this, and if you don't like it, then fine. You're just ungrateful because I really think this is a great gift. I think it's appropriate. I spent a lot of time trying to put thought into it. And I said, Mom, I just really don't think it's the best gift we could give him. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's get him something else. Really, please, could we just, because this is for me, and he's going to think that I'm thinking something that I'm not thinking, and I just really don't like this, and it makes me uncomfortable, and I'm from Seattle, and we're politically correct, and I just don't want to do this. And she goes, well, I just think, you know what? See if I ever do anything for you ever again. I go, go, fine. Go ahead and give it to him then. Throw it in a bucket of fried chicken and some watermelon. It's red and green. Merry Christmas. <laughs> And she gave it to him. But he was a really good sport about it. And then the next year for Christmas, he got me a book on the KKK. So it was nice. 